Thanks for stopping by. This is Two Minute Classroom, and today we're answering the question, what is psychology? I've enlisted the help of someone who knows more about this topic than I do, so he'll take it from here. Psychology is such an interesting topic. Don't you agree? It is so diversified that a person can apply its principles anywhere, such as persuasion and marketing, behavior with children, and research and science. The word psychology comes from the Greek words psyche, meaning soul, and logos meaning to study. All that psychology is, is a study of the human mind and behavior. It just answers the question, why do we do the things we do? From its roots, psychology is just philosophy plus experimentation. Because of philosophy, the history of psychology is so vast. That is a topic for another time. This is just to introduce you to psychology. The official start date of psychology, when it is recognized as a science, is 1879. This is when Wilhelm Wundt created the first psychology lab at the University of Leipzig in Germany. Over time, psychology has evolved with many disciplines of study. Nonetheless, there are two main branches, experimental and applied. Experimental psychology deals with research by way of the scientific method. It answers the questions of why and what. Why is this child acting the way he is? What happens to the mind to cause mental disorders? Applied psychology is applying the research from experimental psychology. Counselors can be found here, therapists, clinic clinical psychologists, applied behavior analysis, and so on. It answers the question of how? How can I make the world a better place? How can I help this child with bad behavior? How can I help this person overcome a mental disorder? As you can see, psychology can soon go off into many directions. Hey, that was my brief introduction to psychology. Please let me know if there are any topics within psychology you're interested in by commenting down below. And please, don't forget to subscribe.